Hi there, Chris here. Um, lots of different cool videos out there uh, this morning. Ricky Lock posted picking one of these S and G's uh, and showed gutting it. Now, unfortunately, this one isn't a gut guttable one because it doesn't have a hole here. Um, but I was able watching him how he picked his to do something a little different, pick it with this pick wire. Um, <laughs> to pick in there and get the the discs in the right the right order. Um, and unfortunately <laughs> I was watching Paul Springett's marathon uh, guessing competition. Ooh, I wonder if this is where that is. Oh, maybe this is got a, well, it has a roll pin. I'd have to take the, drill that roll pin out to get this out. But anyway, what I was saying, I was watching Paul Springett's marathon picking video or picking contest while I was, you know, playing with this and I got it open. So I don't know what I did, but I'll figure that out and try and get that on video for you. There's the bidding on the key. They're not that hard to pick, but you kind of have to work out a tool for them. So there's that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to drill that out or not. Um, the one that I sent him has a hole here, and there's just a, a grub screw in there that comes out. Then you can unscrew this and drop drop the core out. And he showed that, which is very, very awesome. Also, um, um, Brummy picked a beautiful old squire and he mentioned that they are you know they weren't real secure in those days uh, and he picked his with a pick just a pick wire and so I thought I would show this I think I've picked this once before um, but what you do is you come in here and you feel around for a little bit of spring tension and then you know you're on the right track so somewhere in here there we go so I just kept feeling around until I felt a little springy and then gave it gave it a push um, See, do I have my flashlight? You can kind of see in there. Wrong flashlight, or it doesn't work. What's happening? Technical difficulties this morning. I just put new batteries in here, but it's huh, the little spring thing is not going. Well, anyway. You can kind of see in there. Do I have another one? Oh, wrong one. Let's see if I can get you in there. Can we go from here? No, this one you can't really see it. But the technique is take your pick wire and come in here and then just wait till you feel some spring tension and you'll be able to pop them, some of these. Then, Starrylock just posted, I sent him a package with one of these guys in here. Um, this is a newer one, it doesn't have the star and it doesn't have a key. And he posted that package and I thought I would try and pick this I've never been able to pick these. I picked one once. Um, but I watched other people go in there and just pick them. You know, pick right through them. So I thought I would give it another try. William Mansell was great for picking these. Um, I think he was the first one I ever saw really pick one. Other than, I think Lock Picking Lawyer did one. Uh, but there's three pins, and they're way deep inside, and so you use a long, very long hook to get deep in there you 
and I can't even feel any pins. So this may be another fail video. Let me try my regular pick just to see if I can feel anything. Where are the pins? Is it off to the side? No. All right, let me try another one. Let me grab another one. <laughs> I couldn't feel anything in there. But they are they are pickable. These are, you know, these are like master locks. I really suck at them. Well, at least I feel some pins in here. But like I say, they're way, way, way deep in here. Now I don't feel anything. Well, what the heck. Am I picking in the wrong place? Am I going the wrong way? So go this way. Are they here? I don't think that's there. Do a new thing for my pick. Let's try the other one. It's going a long way to fail here. Oh, I feel them up there. Oh my god, I did it. I actually did it. I did it. Wowie zowie. Okay, I kind of picked it upside down backwards, and we're, we're turning, we're turning, we're turning, and you stop, otherwise you got to turn again, and it's $3.99. I did one on camera. <laughs> Way to go. Oh, okay, Star, here's a different, here's a different uh, stamp for you. It's not a star, it's not a nothing. Well, it is kind of a nothing. Anyway, um, there you go. <laughs> I'm very, very happy that I got that one. I'm not, once again, I'm not sure how I did it. All right. Um, thanks for watching. Hit the like, subscribe, leave a comment. Hit the don't like. Say you suck. Um, you're the most selfish person in the world, like my hater thinks. But everybody has an opinion. So um, we will see you next time.